The City of Angels is the latest first-time destination for the world's best sailors. Welcome to the Oracle Los Angeles Sail Grand Prix Port of Los Angeles. This is the second event of Season 4 of Sail G. Three fleet races scheduled for today and another two tomorrow before the all-important event final where only the top three teams will compete. Before we press on to today's racing, let's look back at event number one from Chicago, where the Kiwis claim the top spot on Lake Michigan. Racing here at event number two, season number four. Before we go racing, we want to take you down on the water for a first-hand report. And for that, we check. Hey, Brennan, how's your timing in the middle of the line, Ben Ainsley? Brilliant start by Everest GBR. Absolutely on the money, and they're going to lead the fleet away to mark one here. Perfect. Mark one right there in the set of your screen. Angle. Canada's start was brilliant as well. First boat to turn away, Rockwall, Denmark. They were in disturbed wind. The quickest pass for them was to split away, but out the box to slingshot around the inside. And if you're back in the pack, how do you find space? How do you find clear wind? Well, Eric Heil on board the German. Further on the right, where the British and Kiwis were, it was a little bit less around. 19 Grand Prix and it's the Aussies that roll the dice early and get a little bit lucky. How you liking this, Jigsy? Out to the left-hand side of the course as you look upwind. So, gain for Australia, but Ainsley sailing back towards more wind again. Final to bring a close here at the Oracle Los Angeles. Calculations already being made on board with Tom Slingsby on the course on leg number one to find them. Not a bad showing for MSGBR. GBR. They keep themselves in the conversation. They will take home nine points. But as they have passed the adrenaline round, it is the three-time reigning and defending champions, Australia, that take the win. Race number one here in Los Angeles. Who finished there, Spain? Got Oh, look at this. Clear start again and Rockwell. Mark one comes fast and it's the Danes. Viking power make happen in any maneuver. Yeah, any mistake is going to hurt you here, but we can see there was a slight game for Australia. Ooh. They have the right of way there with Rockwell, Denmark. What a tight move by Sir Hestad. It's so, so Kiwis now getting into the mix. Oh, Slingsby chooses to keep it simple and go straight. It's going to be interesting if he does. It's what we call a very open race course in the sense that there's a lot of area. They have to drop back. They will now be in sixth as they make the turn, which the Danes have just done. Rockwell, Denmark, out win for this team. Yeah, if New Zealand wants it, New Zealand can't quite get there. And Great Britain, they're going to come away here. Third round the mark. Another battle with United Stalin through here. Wide again, though. That's of Rockwell, Denmark, and Nikolai Seth. Here at the Oracle, Los Angeles Sail Grand Prix the foils here can the United States keep it going it's here I don't know it's going to be too little too late and the Spanish are up and foiling wow it was nearly a big mistake here comes oh. Jimmy Spiddle oh he needs to get overlaps he can't quite get alongside the Spanish boat and on board the French Germany need to push across here push 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 Germany might be able to get the speed. Whoever gets up on the foils first is going to have the straight. He's talking about the rudder setting. Germany sneak yep. it there. And it's going to be go in race three. Thank you, okay, let's try and get the bow down. Clear start here. Emirates, Great Britain, perfect timing. They look like they've got the boat going. Drag, they're going faster, but they're struggling to foil. Can clear. Watch them accelerate now on board Emirates, Great Britain. Start here. Those millimetres he was ahead at Mark 1. I think what's a bit counterintuitive here for people watching is that to actually get the boat foiling at nearly 32, 33 kilo foiling at Mark 1, they've just used that speed to generate. But for those boats back in the pack, there is a serious lack. Today, so 22 kilometer per hour winds gusting to 30 kilometers per hour and, and that, that... On the foils, they're going to be going well downwind. Back upwind. Stevie, they're going to have plenty of time to drop into the adrenaline lounge, maybe grab a little Nobu and wait for the rest of the fleet to come home. To see this young Spanish crew there, Florian Trittle, Diego Botin, they work together. Way around that last marker on the top of the course as one of the foils as the Union Jack is out and waving. Emirates GBR bringing it home for a victory here in the third and final race here of day number one at the Oracle Los Angeles Sail Grand Prix. It's the Brits winning race three. Well, that is some margin of victory. Great second place finish for them. Diego Botin in Spain bring it home. They will grab second place. Winner in Chicago was New Zealand as we see Australia coming across the